Hello friends, this is Pankaj and you're watching AM tutorial. If you are a AM developer, then you might have encountered with the parses problem where the height of parses will be around 0 px. For example, here you can see I have this parses where it shows as a line, whereas it should look like this. It should show the component drag components here and it, its height should be around this a to 10 px. So we'll see how you can solve this problem in this video. So let's go to CX console. Let's go to our template, which I have created for you. In the templates here, you can see I've created new templates. Here you can see in this template folder, I have already created a template called a new template, which is pointing to our training component structure demo component. And I have demo components here, which has a HTML file, which has only which has this text, this is my process component and this is the process component I'm using. So let's create a page using this. Let's go to the site console, create a page using this template. Go to the page, select this template, new page, click on next. Give it a name, demo page, demo page. Let's create this, click on open. So when you open this page, you find this, you have this text, this is my parses component, but your parses looks like this, whereas it should have looked like this. It should have drag components here text and its height should be 10 to 15 px, but it's not working like that. So how to resolve this problem? So, so you need to include a file here, which is called init.jsp. So let me put that. So this is the init.jsp file, which is available in the list folder. So now save this file and uh, refresh this page. Now you can see our process is working fine. You can drag and drop any component here. For example, I'm drag and dropping this component here. It's working fine, fine. So this is how you can solve your problem by including this in a .gsp in your component. Thank you friends. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe my channel, like this video and share this with your friends. Thanks again for watching.